Well, the Philip Montgomery era gets underway yeah. Saturday at 2.30. It's a wideout at Chapman Stadium, Skelly Stadium. Gosh, I hope they have a big crowd. We've heard they will, and I, I'm with you. I can't wait to be there at 2.30 uh, for the start of something fresh and new, and, and hopefully that offense is able to move the ball and everybody feels good about it. Right. You need to start with a win. At the Chamber of Commerce dinner, uh -huh. you know, I was supposed to play the Lee Corso role. Yeah. So I predicted The role that, you were born to play. Right. <laughs> Not so fast. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Uh, Got the pencils I, and everything. I, I predicted, I predicted, seventy six points. Whoa! In opening I did not in the know game that. one, and I apologize to Coach Montgomery for doing <laughs> that because I didn't want to. I mean, not that I would well, put any pressure on. Are them. they going to need seventy six points? Florida Atlantic scored fifty on he, them last year in Boca Raton. He, here's how I see the TU season flowing. TU gets up like 55 to 21 and just <laughs> lasting at the end. It just does make it. And I think this is going to be that kind of a game. I think they, um, seven point spread, right? Yes. Uh, I think that's that's about right. That's I think about TU right. comes away with a six to seven point victory. I'll say this. Uh, that defense last year, they, I mean, they were close to dead last in the nation in just about everything. Most of the same guys are back. You don't necessarily have difference makers like a Sean Jackson that you can point to and say, hey, I think this guy can help turn it around. But... I have a lot of confidence in Bill Young uh, and his ability to take guys. You know, at OSU, he did not have top flight defenders, but he had them playing Big 12 championships. They were in the right defense. spots. That's exactly right. I think this defense will be better. How much better? That'll be the difference between a season that's uh, improved at 4 and 8 right. and one that's maybe 7 and 5. I could make a snide remark and say it couldn't get any worse than it was last year. And no, but, that's a fact. no, you're right. Yeah. You're right. But I, I just. I'm, I just want to see this offense click. I want to see Dane yes. Evans finally emerge as a top-notch quarterback. Going, going to the right spots because we know he's got the talent. All right, TU wins 76. <laughs> <laughs> they win handily. 37-28, uh, how about that?